Hello and welcome back to KG Moon vs. All the Mods. As you can see, we got our house in the background coming together. I still can't decide how to do the end caps. It, I am just struggling with what to do with those. You didn't see anything up in the sky. There was nothing there. Uh, that's probably about two episodes ahead of this one. But today, we introduce uh, something that I didn't even know was in the pack. I found it and uh, we figure it out. So we're going to learn plus TIC as well as get some armor so we can go and take some withers and progress in the game. I hope you stick with this. I hope you enjoy. So I've discovered something I didn't know about or hadn't seen before. It's this. Uh, TIC, or I'm sorry, plus TIC. It adds Lumite, which hasn't been a thing uh, in this pack in Tinkers. And we're, we're trying to get some of this other stuff going. But anyway... Um, so we're going to try to get one of these going. I don't know. Let's see if we got our Tinker's Book. This must have been added in the last update. Um, because I don't remember seeing it before. So let's see. Oops. Okay, so I don't think it's in here at all. I guess we're just kind of left to figure this out. I don't see any books or instructions or, or anything of the sort. So, um, we'll just give it a shot, I guess. Um, I know, so we'll need to make some casts. So let's go ahead and get this going. I tell you what, I'll make some casts. We'll get some of the different um, materials together and try a couple of different things out and then see, I guess. All right, I'm gonna try not to get blown up here. We're over here at Earth Smelter. I threw some manilium in. I made our cast. We're gonna do a manilium barrel. Now, it would not let me do a paper battery and I made paper uh, uh, the other thing, and I need a... Oh, you know what we forgot? We forgot... Go, as soon as this cools off, we'll go in and make a... Uh, yeah, we'll go make the paper... Um, we'll go in and make the paper... Uh, we can make something else. Tool rod, that's it. Um, okay... I don't know what I've done with my tough tool rod pattern, but... Alright. There we go. I think that's what we need. So let's try this. We're going to go with that. Battery. Barrel. Tool rod. Barrel. Um. Okay. Oh. Well, okay. Wrong thing. All right, let me get the other thing and we'll be back. All right, through some trial and error, I've discovered a couple things. Um, a lot of the paper tools are locked out. And look at these, uh, the laser mediums. These are the only ones you can do. So they're pretty, um, Morgan Le Fay. That's Merlin's. Oh, oh, that might be interesting. So some pretty unique materials. Um, it wouldn't take this. Well, you know, hang on. I didn't think it would take the stone one. No, see, it wouldn't take the stone. Uh, so I made a flux crystal one. I don't know. You know, I got a paper, paper. I made the manilium on this. So let's check it out. Um, okay. Let's. It takes RF, of course. Alright, so let's uh, give it some RF. Alright, it says it's good. I, I, I don't, I don't know. Five modifiers. Okay, well let's go give it a shot and see. You know what, let's do... Uh, well, I'm thinking of it. We definitely want unbreaking on it. So 
I'm tempted to go ahead and do all five modifiers, but I'm I'm not sure just yet. I do want to get for some of my other tools. Uh, I want to get some of these things going as I walk by. I also want to. I need a couple of oops these. Now, I don't know. I, I'm, I'm curious what we should do. You know what I think I need? I need another table. We'll go ahead and take that table. And there we go. That way we can kind of get some things, some automation going there. I think it's just three, four, five. All right. So that gives us that. And then we'll uh, put Sigmillium. It should start coming out. Or is it off? There we go. All right. We'll let it do its thing there. All right. So... I'm not sure. I I don't know why it's not working. What is this? I, I don't I don't. What in the world? Liquid glass, cobalt, elementium, man of steel. This must be some of the top tier stuff for these things. That's cool. It might be interesting to see. But do I have to have... I just can't shoot. Do I have to have something to shoot at? It says I've got RF. I don't... I don't... See any, like, ammo... Let's go check it out. Let's find find some innocent animal to go murder. Can we find any? Of course. When you want a mob to kill, none to be seen. Ooh, pigs. There we go. Maybe. Peeky, peeky, peeky. Aha! We got one of the poorly rendered ones. Oh! Oh, wow! Did you see that? Oh, that's that's sweet. Okay. All right. We we've got to. Uh, th there's only one thing we can do. I mean. You know what we have to do. Do, do you know what we have to do? We gotta go to the nether. Oh yeah. Now we're gonna go ahead and use um, all of our modifiers up. Alright, there we go. Unbreaking. Now what we're gonna do is uh, we're gonna try to modify that barrel. Let's just do this. I think we can do this. Let's see. What's made out of paper? Because I noticed our durability went way down. Pipe piece. Okay. Okay, the pipe pieces could be anything. So I want to go, you know what? I'll be right back. All right, we're going to try this. Let's see if it'll go ahead and let us swap out this. Okay, I need a modifier to do that. So we will work on that. But it's now unbreaking because the thing I noticed... Oh, hey. Uh, the thing I noticed is that... Uh, let's get rid of all this stuff. That didn't do me any good, so we'll throw that away. 
I'll save those for later. The, the one thing I noticed is that uh, while we did all this, that my durability went way down. That's why I went ahead and just uh, swapped that out really quick. Let's just see if we can throw some of these things. You can tell something I was working on briefly. Let's go ahead and one more thing I want to do is just make sure everything's charged up and ready for action. We got some good food with us. There we go. Got some blocks. Don't really need those, but we'll, I don't want to. I want to use them later. So let's go see what we can do. All right, we're in the Nether. Something must have died right here. Oops. Let's see if we can die ourselves. It's gassed up there. We'll... Okay. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Okay, are we out of power already? No. Hmm. Let's set this aside and pull this down here. Just need to get some milk in our system as well. All right, I got somebody that needs my attention. All right, we're here in the Nether, trying this thing out. But I'm gonna get up here where nothing can try to get up here. Wow, this thing's fast. I've been in here a while. I have this. That way, uh... Is that gonna work? I don't know, maybe. I have this, that way, uh... Alright, I think we can, we can get back where it's safe. Let's get us a little shelf above us. That way nothing can come down. Alright, we're going to try to level this thing up. Give yourself a good view. And here they come. Anybody else? Hmm? Hmm. Okay, that was lackluster. Okay, that's taken us to 128. So I'm just gonna keep working at it and get and uh, we'll get a better bl uh, barrel on it. And then uh, I guess I'll come. Let's just go for it. I'm hoping I can find a ghast and uh, I hear him. I'm hoping I can get a cast and oh what is that? That's different. There's something nether smoker. Okay, I didn't get it, I guess. Hmm. Anyway, I'm hoping that I can get one of these ghasts caught in the net deal. Alright. Awesome. Oh, this would be good for decorations. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, that was close. Luckily, there's some delay with my system, huh? Alright. So, I'm going to just kind of keep going around. Maybe steal a couple more of these things. And, uh, because this will fit really, really well with uh, something I have planned for later. Oh, ow, 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 ow.
So I'll meet you up there when we're leveling up our barrel. Alright, we got it leveled up. So we're going to throw our gun in. Or modifier. So right now, attack speed 3, damage 8. Okay. Put this on. Attack is still 8. Let's see, durability went up, but. Alright, we're gonna try something different. I didn't like what that gave us. So we're gonna do this. We're gonna work our way up to this. I'm saving this for something else. Maybe. There we go. Oops. There we go. Okay. One more time. There we go. Now we come over here. I can't remember if it'll do it this way. I think it's a laser pipe piece we need. Okay. Let's try to melt this down. Alright. We got this here. Um, the millennium gave us Again, it all pretty much three, three, and eight. Positive act, you know, still about the same. So I think we'll look at. Oh, I did this one. See, I'm really not impressed. Um. You know, it gives us prosper and to last on most of the time. I don't want that. That was a waste. Let me give it some more thought. All right, we've been busy. We're doing some testing. <laughs> I have a feeling when I make several of these guns and uh, to figure out what I like, what I don't. But <sighs> just put some refined obsidian. I got, I, I got everything. So we know we don't like the Supremium. Um, I don't want the Prosperous on there. It's kind of a waste if you ask me. So we did check. And I made these two of because <laughs> I messed up. Um, again, really doesn't give us anything we didn't have. Oh, man. Oh, man. I just wasted a modifier. Alright folks, I'm going to remake this gun and we'll try again. Step one, our, our tech damage is already up. Five modifiers again. We're going to level it up. Oh, hang on, I need to do this first. Here we go. Alright, already I'm seeing a difference. Check this out. So we put that different piece on there and it, it's given us much better range and power. <laughs> this is cool. This is cool. Whoa! 
So a ranged weapon that works on anyone. That's... That's awesome. I think it hits so fast that you didn't have time to react. Hey, here's somebody. It's pretty sweet. So I'm gonna level this up and we'll be back. Before working in the garden, I wanna give you um, some of my plans. We're gonna go through, I've got um, some of these done up into the top tier. And we're gonna get the others rolling. Um, I want to talk about my gun a little bit. As you can tell, it's a little more powerful now. I've leveled it up twice, and it's now, um, I put looting three on it, and sharpness on it a couple of times, so the attack's up to 14. We still have the paper handle, but, uh, it's doing pretty good now. So let's take this in and see how many we can do. We're... Uh, kind of what I'm getting planned is we're at that point I, I want to go about three different directions with things so first off oh I sorry about if you got that little ding from my computer I set that aside we'll X this out now you see this these seeds Level 5, level 6, and that's it. They don't go any higher than that. Um, uh oh. Okay. So, let's do this. Let's see how many of them I can do. Um, Alright, so got those done. First row done. So, I'm basically just going to kind of keep doing this for a little bit. Um... And let me keep talking. So I'm wanting to get some basic um, industrial craft going. I've kind of started some some of it, and I, I'm really it's bit, it, that mod has been out for so long. I don't think I'm going to go in depth a whole lot on exactly oops, uh, uh, every step of the process as I go. I may explain some of the things we've got done um, after a while. But not, you know, every little thing. Perfect. So, uh oh. Um, now, in some of my preparation, what in the world? I don't see him. Where is he? Ah, take that. <laughs> um, you may notice those arrows are hurting quite a bit. That is all I've got left of my <laughs> my armor. Um, I found one of those. Um, uh, let's see, what is it called? Something dungeon space. It's just a huge, massive, sprawling dungeon. Like, let me give you an example. Oh, well, you got a flash of it. Um, like, let's see if I can go... Let's see if it'll do that. I won't do it, because I'm, I'm over here. Oops. Oh, well. But this thing here, um, I have that little place because I was working on something here. This dungeon covered this entire area. I mean, it was massive. I'm not even sure I caught all of it. Out of that, I've got all of these spawners. Look at that. See all the spawners I got? And I broke a bunch of them to get these shards. Uh, it's just craziness. So, man, this is great. Um, so I got that going. Um... And, but my while I was doing all that and one other side project I'll explain a little bit later uh, my armor just got absolutely destroyed so it's time to, to work on some better armor um, and I still haven't got all my machines back in their place so I need to work on that as well um, so like I said I'm gonna do 
this. I, 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 the reason I'm not, well, you know what, I may just probably regret this, but let's go ahead and do the call. Anyway, so that's my plan. Uh, the other thing I did is I put, I uh, switched over my AE, or my um, system uh, for the, not ethanol, but the ethylene, ethylene system over to run on all running through the AE system and I'll show you how to do that later because I need to move some things around um, and then I put a massive gas storage disk in my computer and uh, let it go to town and it just it just took out all of my uh, just a few short so let's do this Get there eventually, I promise. Ooh, ooh. All right, let's try this again. All right, I've been working on my essences for this project. There, I can't type uh, for this project here. I used this. I had almost fourteen hundred of these and I've used all of them to do this so yeah um, perfect all right and now that we've done that that'll really uh, enable us to fly with it but anyway so I, I, I said it loose as I start pumping all the extra gas into the system and it went through 50,000 potatoes. Literally 52,000 potatoes. So um, I had to kind of put a smaller disc in and just let it build up my supply again on it. But it is running a lot smoother. Um, I thought I had the lighting updates uh, shut off on mechanism, but I didn't. So I need to look at that again. Um, but, oh, there we go. Now, am I missing one somewhere? do this so it grows up. Now watch how fast it, these things grow now because of the, this level the fertilized soil and the glass. And maybe I can spot the one that's missing. Yep, right there. Alright. Now it's set. So let me go and uh, show you what I've done over there real quick. Alright, show you a few things we got together here. Uh, we are on the top floor. This is the, almost the finished product, and uh, I I don't know. I think I like the inside, but I might change a few little things here and there. But I like all the light. And I ran out of glass. Uh, my EME system I had to make some more discs and swap out the sizes uh, because it was full. Here we've got our. Uh, Barely see the conduit gum coming through here, and it's running underneath it. And we got the link card, and that's going to one of the towers down below, and uh, get, getting its power. I got one line set up running from here to out in there, and I got another one light running. Uh, actually, this one's again we're pulling from the same one. One line running that way, and one line running that way to the corner to uh, set some of our. I'm going to put my mechanism stuff on this side. And uh, not not my my system I have over there, but just like for processing in here. Oops. And uh, anyway, here's what we've got. I've got all these set up with the glowstone and uh, uh, making. Well, let's see. Uh, here's what I've got running. This impulse item duct is very fast. When you make it, it's just regular item duct filled with energized glowstone. And it's it's very fast, and uh, this stuff you take some signalium and electrum, and uh, it gives you this uh, signalium pl place or impulse stuff. It's very fast, but it carries power on with it as well. And that's what I have running along the bottom of these, and then into this chest and throwing things into my system. So like for the interpols that are melting down, 
I threw an entire stack of buckets in here, boom. They all shot straight into the system. Uh, I need to make, matter of fact, I'm about to make um, some more redstone duck, but I'm out of the electrum right now. But you make, make that and then throw it in here, and it makes that. And then to get this, you gotta craft again more electrum around a resonant flux duct. This is how I made this stuff down below. Um, a very tedious process. I took the signalium flux duct, which is again redstone with signalium, one piece of iron again, and uh, gives you this, and then you throw it in, or these. And then you throw it in, in here with the gel, gel gray of them. Which I cheated my way around that. Um, you can refuse snowballs with redstone. And it'll give you the blizz powder. And then uh, you craft all that together to give you the cry theme. Then you melt it down in here. And in, so that's kind of the process there. So that's gives that set up. Eventually I'm going to put my ME system running into here. Maybe. Um, I may be about the point we're about done with that. I'm gonna make some armor that that uh, requires us to throw diamonds in here and electrum plates in here or electrum and stuff in here. Because um, my armor, as you see, that's all that's left for because of a, one project I was working on um, down here. I made this crafting station down here, and uh, if you look at this make like this like this probably ought to put a water station down there for water buckets now that I think about it anyway um, oh you can even see it, it says infinite well, that's how you get it there I forgot to put my covers there so I'll have to do that and then uh, gave myself a tank there so let's go ahead and uh, outside I'm not sure if I like it or not um, oh I can't see it. just basically you take some sticks to make these uh, from a cat craft rates really simple recipe to make all those and I got that going with that and uh, I'm gonna probably make this I can't decide what I want to do on the front just yet but uh, we use slabs on the top to keep things from spawning. And I'm hitting a little bit of lag, but I think it's because I'm uh, uh, rendering a video right now. Uh, should be episode 13. Uh, anyway, so I'll come back in a little bit. Well, actually, let me just show you uh, while I'm at it. I am wanting to get into this old because that how you make the enderium, okay? Um, I gotta crush more down to do it, but anyway. Alright, we're wanting to do a couple of things. Um, I changed my system up over here a little bit. Um, it is inputting, and I've got it shut off right now because I'm, I'm doing something. I'll show you what in a minute. But it's inputting the blocks in here, and then I changed my crafting recipes to, to automatically take these blocks and move them up to here and then kick them back out, out of the system or into the system but I shut it off because we're working on a couple of things here oh I also um, updated my crafting I added a third one uh, as my small one and what the way I activated these I activated this one this one this one that way this is always the primary uh, it sees this is the first one and uh, tries to craft with it first I think that's the way it sets up this is the big boy I mean I've got all those 64s in there and then co-processors in it to make it uh, be able to craft multiple parts at once um i shut that back here so we can do some of the crafting uh to make these and uh we're getting our prosperity shards out of the uh, out of uh our mine over there and i i need new armor so we're going to try a couple of different things uh first thing we're going to try Yes, I made some of these, the sticks and feathers, you know, uh, and such. Because I want to get this up and start building um, 
the better levels of things. Now, first off, I want to get a workbench. We're going to go ahead for the top tier workbench. But in order to do that, I've got to take things up a notch. And let's go ahead because I'm going to use... Ooh, no, I don't, I don't want to do that. All right, that gives us that. Now we need to do that. Ah, uh, see, that was the only drawback. And I'll have to start it uh, crafting all the way down um, for each level to get it until we get this done. And then after that, it won't be a big deal. Um, There we go. There we go. All right. So we'll just keep taking these all the way up. And uh, don't remember how many of these I I know I need some more I should have set this as remember all right so just keep working your way up to each level we got a blue so now we'll go red uh oh what did I do here oh it gets more intense now And to take this up to the Insanium, goes back to the same, oh, hmm. All right. So now, there we go. We've got that table to be able to, to uh, modify things in and do the cores and such. And let's see what we have to do to get the broadheads. You have to get each of these because I want to try. Let's try this core. I need the core. Oh, problem. Oh, no, because what we're trying to do is this. Okay, I have to have nether stars. All right. Um, need a different kind of armor. Uh, hang on. We'll come back. All right, we're starting to work on our armor, and uh, we threw some diamonds in here to to give us these flux crystals. Um, for all the this flux armor we're going to make, we need these things, which take flux electrum, which take which the way you make uh, flux electrum plates, I should say, which <laughs> are made but in the induction smelter with this stuff so we've crafted uh, 200 of them up we've got them cooking up over here and I ran out of sand again so let's try this again here Still working on the sensitivity of my mouse. My kids got me a brand new mouse. Um, it is fantastic. Uh, it's the Razer Naka N2, but uh, still kind of playing with my settings and everything. That's why you're going to see me bouncing all over the screen every once in a while. All right, we're back. I think I got everything prepared. Uh, the only thing we need to make another one of these rods, and we're going to use those that, like this. Because we're going to need these here in a little bit. Okay. Oh, we might need a couple because I want to do I want to do this too. Let's go for it. Boom. We got a shield. There we go. Cool. Uh, let's do... I already made one of these. You may have saw me carrying it around and using it. We got the bow. Boom. It's filling up. And I want to try this. Check this out. 
So, yeah, it, it's a charged quiver. So, yeah, that's, and everything's charging up. If you remember, we've got that wireless charger down there. Um, all right. All right. I was going to use this. Let's go ahead and get the sword while we're at it, too. Might as well deck ourselves out and see how all this does. Um, now that we made these, here we go. Got the pants. There we go. We got boots. There we go. Let's see. Helmet. Like that. And last but not least, that gives us the chest plate. Now, it used to be able to connect this. Oh, okay. So we can still connect this to a jetpack. Oh, that might be helpful. Because I want to get true flight. Um, how do we make. Oh, we got everything to make this. Let's do it. There we go. Okay. Oh, let's see. Maybe I didn't make it. Every once in a while I've noticed AE doesn't pull certain things in. Now that won't charge like that. And we need some kind of plate to attach it. Okay. Um, we have the steel plate. We can make that. Let's just, uh, oh, okay. Let's see how we use this. Um, <laughs> doesn't like those, apparently. <laughs> Great. Oh, there it is. And we use this. Okay. In a compressor. Okay, so we'll have to. We'll have to. That'll be something we'll do later. Um, but yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, what is up with our glass? Okay, that's odd. Anyway, so let's take this off. Let's go ahead and turn our cosmetic armor off. Okay, um, I still got my remote on my head. <laughs> uh, I can't remember, okay. Do I have to take it off for it to show? Oh, that's what we do. Oh, see, it's going to show, it shows over, okay. So if we're going to use this and show it off, we have to... Actually, that's not bad. What do you think? Oh, 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 let's do this the right way here. Yeah, check me out. Whoa. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. I think... Let's, let's see, there's a key binding that... Um, Controls. Um, I think it's in COFH. Let's check it out. Because um, we can turn that. Okay, four. All right. So. Ha 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 ha. Ba 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 Now, does it drain my power just sitting there? No, it only drains it when it's in use. Okay, so nine. What do we got on this? So I would say we are ready to go. I would kind of like to have looting in my sword, but oh well. All right, so check this out. What do you think? Huh? Yeah, yeah, that's cool. All right, so we have our shield. We have our sword. We have our bow. Boom. How does this look when we shoot? Oops. 
So it's actually a little redstone arrow. Okay. So let's go... Uh, let me find somewhere to put this. We'll be right back. Well, folks, that's going to have to wrap the episode. I'm sorry it went so long. Uh, I'm packing in everything I can in, into these, trying to get everybody caught up. But uh, I, I'm, I'm, this w gun... OP. It's been great waiting till you see what it does. Um, I cut right there because I went right back and and took care of our withers and waiting to see the greatness that it does. We had a good time with that and we'll jump right back into things with the next episode. Should be up um, if not tomorrow, the day after and by the end of the week I think we'll have everybody caught up. So thanks a lot. Please come back again.